I found out one of the big reasons that I married my wife was a lie. Should I bring it up? We started dating at 18, right after I 27 and joined the military. She 27F is a local where I got stationed. About three months into dating, I found out I was being deployed. I pretty much gave her the option to break off the relationship. Because that's totally not fair to her. Well, she said, let's keep in touch. So that's what we did. We stopped dating but kept in touch. We officially started dating again around the end of my deployment. I knew for those few months at the beginning of my deployment, she was probably dating around. But when I came back, she had told me that she never met with any other guy or dated since I've been gone. She said that she waited until I came back. I took this as a huge green flag. I know how gullible I am for believing that, but I was 18 lol. Well, I took that green flag seriously into account before I decided to pop the question a couple years later. Fast forward. I'm happily married to her with two sons. Recently, our toddler needed a tablet to watch Dancing Fruit and such. We decided to use her old iPad. This iPad hadn't been used since the beginning of our relationship. I forgot to turn on guided access before putting our other son down for a nap. Well, our oldest son figured out how to FaceTime people. He pretty much FaceTimed a bunch of her family members and a couple of her old friends. After I heard people talking to my son, I ran in and ended the call. Some of the people my son called had hearts and heart eye emojis. I got curious and opened the messages. They didn't pick up my son's FaceTime attempt, thank God. Then I saw some explicit messages dated back when I was on my first deployment. She was with a couple guys after I left on my first deployment. This hurt me pretty bad especially after reading those texts. Should I even bring this up to her? It was so long ago. We weren't officially dating and she hasn't talked to those guys since then. But her saying she waited for me was a big factor into asking her to marry me a couple years later. I know that I shouldn't have clicked those old messages. I wish I never did. Update. I think people were confused about the question that's my fault. It's not the fact she slept with other guys while I was gone we weren't dating. I just wondered why she'd said that to me. If someone said I waited for you for 9 months while you were deployed and didn't date or sleep with anyone else, wouldn't that make you feel special? Also, I saw some comments saying how do you know she slept with them. The texts were definitely clear on that her his address, pictures, I'm on my way texts, a lot more but I'm not posting it, and no, I didn't sleep with anyone while deployed. How it came about, she said when we first started dating, she didn't believe that I hadn't slept with people on the deployment. She asked me first if I slept with anyone on deployment and I said no. I asked her the same and she said no as well. She kept teasing me about it. So I just gave her my phone password. She confirmed I that I didn't sleep with anyone. Even throughout the dating phase, she checked my phone. I personally don't care, so I asked my wife and just told her the truth about the FaceTime or iPad situation. Her point of view, she was under the impression at the time from her girlfriends that all military guys do on deployment is sleep around. So at the moment in her life she didn't think it was a big deal she slept with other guys. Which is fine because we weren't together. You guys are correct, she never dated any of them. It wasn't until she looked through my phone while we initially dated, she felt guilty. We were about four months into dating and didn't want to lose me by telling the truth. She said that she hasn't talked to any of those guys since we started dating and married. She felt trapped in this lie she made and I understand that. I want to say that I understand the stigma of military's guys and cheating or sleeping around. No one knows that better than other veterans. My point of view, I don't care that she slept with guys on deployment. We weren't dating at that time. My problem was that she lied about it. Then finding out years later through my son and seeing those raunchy text messages are kinda a big punch to the gut. The end. She apologized for lying. I understand why she lied. She understands why it hurt me so much. I've seen posts saying that's what 18 year old do lie. You know, you're right. I wasn't the perfect 18 year old either. So why did I bring it up? I saw a comment saying why are so many people afraid to talk to their spouse? You're right. In the end, we love each other. If I've done something to hurt my wife, I'd want to make it right vice versa. I've also seen a comment saying if it doesn't come out now, it will fester and build up. Then eventually, it'll come out during a really bad fight in the future. Was that lie a red flag? Yes. But I let one red flag cloud all the amazing stuff she's done in our relationship. A commenter helped me realize this. 
We are together for the long haul. The kids and this little family are our priority now. No, I'm not holding a grudge against my wife. No, I'm not divorcing her. No, I'm not gonna control my wife. She's a good woman.